found those Gucci shoes. We got ourselves a nice little desk here. Just a simple little, uh, little school desk. Nothing wrong with that though. good news I was able to get one of those tables I'm determining whether I want to go and grab the other one now the problem is I don't think I have room for the other table the reason I even took one was mr. sleeps a lot can sell that bad boy for us and pick up a good easy 20 30 bucks for that and so that's actually a win-win right there I also wish potentially that we could have picked up Obviously, I could break down that storage unit. It's missing the wood, but that's a great storage rack. You know when everyone says everything but the kitchen sink? Well, I think that literally took that to a degree. That's a kitchen sink. Like a monster, beautiful looking stainless steel kitchen kitchen sink. Scrap that. Where's my boy? Where my scrapper guys at? Where my scrapper gals at? Let's scrap that from metal. That thing gots to be worth at least three large pizzas. Extra toppings, baby. Let's go ahead and cruise on up here. I wanted to take a look at this one more time. It's stacked in the Gillicuddies. Let's see if it's just boxes. What's that on the ground? Oh no. Do I have to get out in the cold? Uh, it looks like just a bag. What's over there? Mm, do not know. Someone just literally purged all their baby stuff. And that stinks because it all just got soaked. Oh man, I was able to grab some of those child protection cabinet lock thingamabobbers, see if those are worth anything. If not, I will definitely see if Mr. Sleepslot needs those. Let's see what we got over here. Looks like another headboard, 
and some boxes there. Headboard is down about 50 feet. We have a nice Ikea desk right there, single chair with a nice little three drawer cubby system. How about that? I didn't even see this over here because there were cars. There's a full crib right there up against the half wall too. That is a lot of stuff. Some sort of mechanical adjustable bed as well. See, the problem is I think that too many people don't think that there's gonna be rain and we haven't had this much rain, I, I don't even remember. I mean, there's just storms coming in like every other week, which is kind of a bummer. So people see blue skies and then it's like Hawaii, like in an hour later, it's downpouring. So they're putting all this baby stuff out and it's just getting drenched. Of course, it could be washed off, put out in the sun and dried, but oh man, I'm just, I'm seeing a lot of product even in a rainy season. There's stuff down that pipe but normally that's just garbage. That's known as the garbage pipe down there. Let's see, live right here with you. Let's see what's going on down this pipe. A hey, shopping cart. All right, I don't know what uh, brand that is, uh, but that is a luggage compartment holder again for some sort of automobile. I definitely need to go in for a closer look and scope that out. I'll uh, turn around. Well, it's not BMW, it's Xterra, but I'm not gonna let that stop me from grabbing that bad boy. That could be upwards of $200 worth of car parts. I don't know quite yet, I'll research it later on or even tomorrow, but God willing, we can sell that and make some of that Xiaomi influence. Five scooter money, baby. How about a hard shell suitcase right on top, mattress, and some other goodies. Well, it's 43 degrees here. That's really, really cold for us at nighttime. But if you want to get a little bit more chilly, there's a, a box fan for you there. I'll save you 15 bucks. Chris, I've counted, I've watched your videos, and I've counted four hard shell suitcases that you have found and kept. You don't need any more hard shell suitcases. You're 100% correct. But we grabbed that one because that one I think is really expensive. So we're going to see if we can sell the bad boy. If we can't sell it, of course, we're going to first see if any Anybody needs it if no one needs it then of course Salvation Army baby and let them take the beautiful cha-ching it's gonna come to their pocket Sometimes with situations like that, you just have to go in and look, even though it is 43 degrees now, you just gotta go look. There could have been action in those boxes.
That's why I love night times, folks. I was just rummaging around, doing a little bit of shopping. Let's go shopping. When? How about tomorrow? Found those Gucci shoes underneath the pile. Wow, unfortunately, there's another, see, there's another little baby thing. Unfortunately, all that got rained on. Luckily, those nice shoes were underneath the pile, but so much clothes just sitting in the rain all day. But we were able to rescue the Under Armour shoes, the Nike shoes, the Gucci shoes. We should be able to make some sweet dollar bills. <laughs> Off those bad boys. Thank you, Lord, for the blessings. One, two, three times, baby. Ooh.